Yo, welcome guys. Today's video, maybe you're wondering why we're here in game. So that's because I'm gonna show you the crater. So what this crater means is basically it's used for killing NPC or giving experience when you kill some when you when you kill NPC or player. That's like that, just like this video. So in my game I use that method. So all the game. All the game you play on Robux with experience and killing NPC, it has method of crater. So what crater is? So basically crater is just object value. So if you don't know the object value it's like string value, volume value, and a number value, but object value contain a object. It can contain part or model, even your player on players. So let's start. Up. Let's get started um, by making a simple. Um, Tool, because why not tool? So sometimes on sword, on combat system. So you need this. So here I add a local script and begin begin to scripting. So here local tool is equals to script the parent and tool active. It means when you click the tool, when you click the mouse, um, left mouse, left mouse, left mouse, mouse and left, yeah. <laughs> and now it, the handle touch, which um, we're using touch event and parameter with hit, and if hit point first child humanoid, so it basically finding a humanoid if it's a if the hit has humanoid so it means it's a NPC or player but we don't want to hurt our own character so that's why we need the, we need the seven line so making a new variable again local char for character and it goes tool that parent because with that parent is will be our character so if hit that parent oops if hit that parent that name it means our na our character name is not equals to character name means if hit that parent is not equals to our name so if it's not then so making me another variable for debounce. If debounce is equals equals to false, then debounce is equal to true. Wait one second. And debounce is equal to false. And here we can put a code. Find a code here. So basically what you're doing is take damage because we want to take damage the the model that we hit <coughs> it's like on sword here if play it and wait something wait some mm. and if I hit this without clicking does as you can see no damage no damage but if you click this see if you click this here the dummy get take damage so let's see it now you can make your own sword but where's the crater what where's the crater where's the crater so here it comes 
so um, maybe we should make a variable for human local human is equal to copy here base here and put here and put here so now the creator is basically our J is object value contain object even your player your character or model or port whatever it is to any any object so local creator human for humanoid find first child creator if there's so now we're making if statement if there you creator on your humanoid one or print it has creator or else if the humanoid can doesn't have creator we need to make a greater by making a by using instance dot new local new creator equals to instance dot new object value with parent of humanoid and the name is greater with small c not capital it's up to you but almost um, <coughs> excuse me so the value is will be play a new game take quest kill RPC or kill my RPC play now get the distance or player so by making a logo and uh, by making variable for our player so local player equals to game get service players are players and get player from character char so maybe we put this here yes here and now we have our player so now we have the value of our new creator and set the value of the old creator to our player too so changing his head if we play this so just wait a second to load it okay so now as you can see these two don't has a greater on their humanoid so now I add this one and call it creature now look at the outfit and if you play this it has creature yes it has creature but oh it doesn't have body but I already set it so maybe the run is on player yeah it's on player so let's test here another run if it make a, a new a new crater once so as you can see I hit the dummy tries, uh, three times but their creature only one crater but the body is the problem. Why? So maybe I'll let this one and call the service. So local flares for get service flares and local player equals to player that local player. Now we set it. 
and see first thing first I need to add this one yes or no yes to pass and now if you click this yeah it, it has trigger and the dummy has got the creator of this dummy is now it's mine so the value is my now is my player now is my player it's me so if the if the dummy die you can you can access on my player which is I'm the creator I kill you because if someone if someone mm, hit that dummy the value of creator will change so now but we can test it because I don't want to make this be just so long so I don't use remote event for this video but at least you get the point we can access our we can access our player when the dummy dies because it has creator so when it dies for example dummy that humanoid that die if humanoid has creator then humanoid that creator is equal to killer now we can access the killer because it's our character it means if if the if that humanoid died and has a creator on the humanoid with value you can give them experience because you already access the that player the only one player which is me this one which is the value of creature so now here if we wait he um folder and I get letter step and here int value now we can see this gold and now as you can see we can access the looter step of our player or the data store of the ser or the data of the player we can get can give experience we can give gold we can give anything to this to this player so i hope you understand thank you for watching guys don't forget to subscribe like this video and comment down below what next video <laughs>